this park here has been so much more than just a basketball court to so many other people. It's a place where you can escape, it's a place where you can be free. It's a wonderful thing to see everyone come together through basketball. Prairie Summer Jam is a celebration of basketball and all the elements that combine, I suppose, the park and the urban culture around Paran, Melbourne, and therefore Australia. I never thought it would grow to what it is now. We get now 5,000 people coming down to the court um, every tournament. You have your rich, you have your poor, you have people that are very talented in basketball, people who just love the sport. It's crazy that you'll see guys like Daniel Dell coming through the Paran Summer Jam in 2012, and now he's in the NBA. Dell Smith, oh, what a sweep! We're just, we're just passionate about basketball, and we're fans of the game. We're fans of NBA, and we're fans of Melbourne basketball. That's as simple as that. Culturally, basketball has been associated with that sort of street sort of area. Ten years ago, it was the baseball caps or the Yankees and the Dodgers caps, but now you're seeing, you know, the Lakers, the Celtics jerseys. And they're just like role models for us. Some people not even for, like, basketball, just to, like, for the fashion or for, like, the culture. Oh, Curry, yeah, Victorians and the city of Melbourne, they love basketball and um, the popularity of, of our team and, and our league continues to thrive and grow from the popularity of the sport. Whether it be your favourite player on the back of a jersey or I see a lot of kids just walking down the street dribbling a basketball or their local association, they got the shorts on. It's cool for our sport, uh, it's cool for our city. The grassroots is just stronger than ever and we have an amazing system through our associations and clubs and how they operate and how they run to produce great players. I think that the biggest advantage Melbourne or the state of Victoria has is that it has unbelievable facilities. Uh, the development from the grassroots, the opportunities for people of all levels to play is vastly different to what it is in New South Wales. You know, this is the hub of Australian basketball. There's a lot of talent. I think, you know, everyone knows that Melbourne has had two of the number one picks since Bogues went number one. So, um, you know, that's a pretty amazing accomplishment. I think we're on an absolute crest of a wave uh, of it being the sport. And in Melbourne, it's just been embraced. We've just launched our second team in Melbourne in the southeast, in the heartland of uh, basketball. It is the number one sport out in that region by a long way.